Hi, this is Chris Waterman. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. Right now, we're going to talk to you about the HARP program. HARP, H-A-R-P, stands for Homeowner Affordable Refinance Plan. This is part of the 2009 stimulus package passed by Congress, and it's to help homeowners who are underwater or upside down on their mortgage. Now, with the, stay tuned because at the end of this video, I'm going to provide the details on how you qualify for this program. But it's for any homeowner who has reasonable to good credit, so a 640 credit score or better, no mortgage lates in the last 12 months, and your uh, current loan needs to be owned and serviced by Fannie Mae or Freddie Mac. So currently, you actually may have a loan servicer of Wells Fargo or City or Chase or Bank of America, for example, but Fannie Mae or Freddie Mac may actually own that loan. So we have a lookup tool, and I'm going to provide that information at the very end of this video on where you can go to look up with Fannie Mae and with Freddie, Freddie Mac if your mortgage is actually owned by them. If it is, and you've kept your credit clean, and you have a 640 credit score or better, you have a great chance of qualifying for this program. Now I'm going to get into more details just in a moment, so stay tuned. Thank you. Hi, this is Chris Waterman again. Let's get down to the details of the HARP, which is the Homeowner Affordable Refinance Plan. First of all, your loan needs to be owned by either Fannie Mae or Freddie Mac. So you can go to both of their websites. Just see below in this uh, slide, you can actually uh, type that in or actually below this video, I provided a couple of links, but go to um, both Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac's websites and input your name and your address into the fields and it'll tell you if your mortgage is owned by either Fannie Mae or Freddie Mac. Now Freddie Mac is also going to ask for the last four digits of your social security number so just be aware of that. Now if you do find that either on Fannie Mae or Freddie Mac that your loan is owned by either one of them then um, let me provide you with the rest of the basic qualifications okay so your loan must have been originated prior to May 31st 2009 okay you must have paid your mortgage on time for the last six months and have not been late more than 30 days in the last 12 months so what that basically means is one mortgage late in the last 12 months in the most recent six months though no mortgage lates and obviously if you've had no mortgage lates at all ever that's going to be the best situation um, you must have a minimum of a 640 credit score or better now listen the higher your credit score the better chance you have to qualify in fact as your credit score goes up the easier it is to qualify and the more upside down you can be on your mortgage and that's very important so let's say for example you're upside down by 150 160 percent um, of what the um, value of your property is your property has dropped that much in value and you're like gee how do i get out of this thing well having a 640 or a 660 credit score won't be enough you're going to need to be close to 700 credit score in order to borrow that much money against the appraised value of your property and you must have verifiable income okay so those are the basic um, guidelines for the heart program if you feel like you'd qualify based on the basic qualifications that I just provided you in the previous slide then call or email me um, my name is Chris Waterman my phone number is 303-738 3838 and you can always email me at chris at watermanteam.com. Thanks so much and look forward to talking to you.